1969, man performed two feats that staggered the imagination of the American public. One took place in mid-July, 250,000 miles from planet Earth when man first landed on the moon. The other took place in October, here on planet Earth on a baseball diamond This nation should commit itself before this decade is out of landing a man on the moon. Yes, indeed. They've got the flag up now. A president of the United States. 1969 was the year that we became us. It was the year we arrived. It was a time when incredible things seem almost guaranteed. They have upset the Baltimore Colts. There were good times and bad times. The speed of which things change could leave you dazed and confused. But in 1969, I don't know what was more amazing. You could not believe it. Where we ended up, or how quickly we got there. We were real long shots to win anything in 1969. 100 to 100 dog, New York Mets. Opening day, April 8th. We lost at home to Montreal. First Canadian lineup for a major league game. In the first game in their history. There were signs, though. We scored four in the bottom of the ninth and lost by one. We hovered around 500 for the first two months of the season. But every story has to start somewhere. May 28th is when we started our streak with an extra inning. We wouldn't lose a game for two weeks after that. By the end of June, it really felt like Times they were a changing. We won five straight when the Cubs came from New York and July. Once we got Ken Denham, things kind of fell in place. We seemed to find out a niche. The next night, Tom was something more than terrific. And he damn near throws a perfect game. Retired the first 25 he faced. A clean hit to left center field, and there goes the perfect game. Jimmy friggin' Qualls. <laughs> ah, the applause for Dodson. We had arrived. We took a giant leap forward. Airman from the planet Earth, first set foot upon the moon. And we all sat there in disbelief. Something like that could happen. And you talk about metaphors, we just look at each other and said, you know, why not? July 1969. It was just one of those moments. We came back to Earth in August, though. We got swept by the Astros. And we fell nine and a half games out of first. Then, as the rain fell in New York, we just started rolling. Four wins in two days. 13 out of 14. We kept rising in the standings, and we were ready to make a move towards first place. By the time the Cubs come back in September, the lead was down to two and a half games. They knew we were coming for them. The next day, Seaver is on the hill. Then the black cat. Black cat comes out and stares down the Cubs' dugout. And we knew it was all over for the Cubs. Tom tossed a complete game, won seven to one. The next day, we swept the Expos in a doubleheader to take first place. So for the first time in the history of the New York Mets, they have gone into first place. Never look back. I'm all in short, this could be it. We kept the good times rolling right into October. We swept Hank Aaron and the mighty Braves. Dropped out to third. Garrett has the ball. A third of first. It was on to the World Series. If you pick it on paper, it's the Orioles. And people sometimes forget how good those Baltimore teams were. 
four World Series in seven years. It was a logical favorite against the amazing New York Bulls. We split the first two games at Baltimore. And the series is now tied at one game apiece. And then it was off to New York to make history. Racing hard as AJ. It wasn't about what people thought we were capable of. It was about what we knew was possible. Next win their second straight. Now tell AG and Foboda. It's two of the greatest catches I, I've ever seen. Foboda making another sensational catch for the Mets. It was amazing. It was unforgettable. It was so loud. The Mets win the ball game by a score of 2 1. Now we're just one win away. See, a baseball with shoe polish on it. Well, I want first base, another shoe polish play. I think the Orioles are pretty mad about that one. Going down for a home run for Clint Dunham. We come to play. This is the club that played the way, this way all year long. We came from behind. We did it today. I'm proud of what we accomplished. I think all of us are. Certainly all the wonderful players that we had this year that have done such an outstanding job, and we must not forget all the beautiful fans that we had in Jay Stadium. It's been a great year, and thank God uh, it's over now. was miraculous.